Hi students, we are going to the video planes 9. The question says a hexagonal lamina 30 mm side rests on HP on a corner A, corner A. Hexagonal lamina rests on HP on a corner A. Corner A. Agree? Corner A. With the surface making some angle to HP, surface making some angle to HP, and the diagonal containing A. What is the diagonal containing A? This is the diagonal. This is the diagonal. I am holding on the diagonal. This is the diagonal which contains A. The diagonal containing A making plan of the diagonal containing A making 55 degrees to equivalent. Where is the plan of the diagonal? This is the plan of the diagonal. If you drop it down, drop it down. This is the plan of the diagonal. That diagonal making 55 degrees to XY line. That means it's not like this, it has to be rotated. Agree? Now, what is this plan? This plan is a compressed hexagon, isn't it? The inclination to HP is given. It's a compressed hexagon. Plan is a compressed hexagon. This plan and this plan are the same. This plan has this diagonal A, B, C, D, A, D, A1, D1, or the diagonal A, D. The plan of this diagonal AD now is parallel to x y line. Make it 55 degrees to x y line. That means redraw the second plan to get the third plan and project a new elevation. Agree? Beta of the diagonal is given. Beta of the diagonal is given. I am adding one more question into this. Phi of the diagonal given as 35 degrees. Everything else remains the same. The hexagonal lamina rests on HP on a corner with the surface making 40 degrees to HP. And the diagonal containing A rests on HP on a corner A. The diagonal containing A making 35 degrees to VP. The first is plan of the diagonal containing A makes 55 degrees to x line. Second is diagonal containing A makes 35 degrees to VP. In the first case, beta of diagonal is 55. In the second, phi of diagonal is 55. You know how to draw when beta and phi are given. We have learned it in some other problem. I will draw first. x y line. I draw the hexagon. A, B, C, D, E, F. A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, E dash, F dash. Lamina lying on HP with the corner A on the left side. That is very important. You have to keep that A on the extreme left. That means one side of the lamina has to be parallel to XY line so that you get a corner on the left side. You cannot draw in any other position because the details given are related to this particular diagonal. That, that diagonal has to be kept parallel to VP in the initial position. The lamina has to rest on HP. One side has to be parallel to VP so that this diagonal becomes parallel to VP. Then only you can draw. Then only when you tilt, that surface will make 40 degrees to HP and that, that diagonal keeps remain parallel to VP. Then only you can rotate. Otherwise, the angle will be different. Okay. Now what? Choose A1 dash anywhere on XY. Draw a 40 degree line, take this distance and mark on it. This is D1 dash. These are the other two points which you call as B1 dash, C1 dash, E1 dash, F1 dash. This angle is 40 degrees. Draw a new plan. A1, B1, C1, D1, E1, F1. This is the diagonal which we are concerned about, AD. Now what? In the first question, you have to redraw this. How? Draw a line at 55 degrees to XY line. Beta equals 55. Choose this A1, D1. 
and mark a2 d2 choose these two points mark draw two perpendiculars there this distance equal to this distance that is equal to this this is equal to this mark them connect you have got the same plan pre drawn a2 b2 c2 d2 is already there e2 f2 draw vertical projectors up very light draw horizontal projectors A2, A1 dash, A2 dash, B2, B1 dash, B2 dash, C2, C1 dash, C2 dash, D2, B1 dash, D2 dash, E2, E1 dash, E2 dash, F2, F1 dash, F2 dash. Connect. Which is the diagonal we are con concerned about? AD. This is the diagonal which we were speaking about. Plan of the diagonal makes theta equal 55 degrees to x y. Agreed? In the next question, what is given? Phi of the diagonal. You know what is to be done. Find beta from phi. How do you do that? Draw a horizontal line. I will draw it here. Draw a horizontal line. I'll draw it here. Draw a horizontal line. Take two length of diagonal and draw an draw a line at phi. Phi equals 35. What is this? This is D. This is A. Draw a locus. What is this? This is T L of A D. Rule length of A D. Take the plan length of AD from the second plan. This is the plan length of AD, A1, D1. With D as center cut and arc. What is this? PL of AD. PL of AD, A1, D1. This angle is called beta. Either make it here or make it separately and find out beta and with that beta draw the same thing a2 d2 b2 c2 e2 f2 this is the calculated value of beta you can write down if you get beta you have to write beta is equal to say uh, 62 degrees suppose you will write beta equals 62 degrees draw vertical projectors up draw horizontal projectors this level do not change this level because the level is decided by this e level in the do not be there this will not be there in the second question this will not be there this is first question, this is second question. You will get a very similar shape because there is small difference. I, I don't know, I don't know. Varchi gayi mein the difference on down there is no difference. You will get a very similar drawing. This sort of questions come in second question. This sort of questions come many times. I hope it is very clear. When beta is given, take it directly. When phi is given, find out beta. Okay, when beta is given, it will be given as 55 degrees to xy line. Some people say plan of the diagonal makes 55 degrees to instead of xy line, some say VPU. That also is not wrong. Plan makes some angle. When you refer plan and elevation, you refer to xy line usually. When you refer plan and elevation or top view or front view, you refer to xy line. When you refer an actual line, you refer to 
एच पी एन बी पी सो इफ यू से द टोप बी ऑफ द डायगनल ए डी मेक्स फिफ्टी फाइव डिग्रीज टू यू हेव टू से एक्स वाई इवन इफ दस एट बी पी इट इज नॉट कंप्लीटली रॉन्ग हियर यू विल बी सेट द डायगनल मेक्स थर्टी फाइव डिग्रीज टू बी पी नेवर टू एक्स वाई बी पी थर्टी फाइव डिग्रीज टू बी पी दैट मीन्स इट इज फाइव थर्टी फाइव इज फाइव फाइव इक्वल टू I hope you understand. It's an important question. We have done similar questions in uh, pentagonal lamina and in circular lamina also, but they were set, uh, pentagonal lamina was stand, standing on a side, uh, circular lamina was standing on a point of its base uh, circle, circumference point on the circumference. Here it is resting on a corner. This can stand on a side also. Similar question can be made. Okay then. Thank you.